So we performed a study from the Eurog Institute for Mummies and the Iceman on the Iceman mummy, who is a 5,300-year-old mummy that was found in the Italian Alps. And we studied the stomach content of the mummy because we detected about three years ago that the stomach is still preserved and it was still filled with material. So we wanted to know in this project whether, on the one hand, what was his last meal composed, but also whether there's still bacteria preserved in his stomach. And there's one bacteria which is of particular interest for research because it's a very frequent bacteria. It's called Heligobacter pylori. It's a pathogen that is frequently present also in the modern population. We have about half of the population has this bacteria in the stomach, and in about 10% it causes diseases like gastritis, gastric ulcer, or even stomach carcinoma. So the idea was to see whether in the Iceman we also have this bacteria. And first we made a histological study, but we couldn't find anything because the gastric mucosa in his Iceman stomach was no, no more preserved due to degradation. But we may, then made a genetic approach and with the first attempt we already could see there is something present. So the next step was to reconstruct the whole bacteria, to sequence the full bacteria, also to be able to compare it with modern strains to get information on the evolution of this bacteria because we know from previous studies that this bacteria is probably present since the onset of mankind. And now in the future we are planning to extend these investigations by comparing this bacteria we found in the Iceman with other pathogens in other mummies. We hope to be able to find this impact in mummies from South America, from Asia, to get more information on the evolution and the onset of this pathogen.